In this lesson, we are going to look at employees' liability in relation to the law of tort. Employees' liability considers the liability imposed on an employer. For example, uh, let's take ABC Private Limited, who employs John Doe. Certain elements in the workplace, uh, as well as the conduct of the employer, is considered in order to determine what obligations it has, as imposed by law, in relation to its employee, John Doe. Now, in Wilson and English, we see several components being considered to determine what liability must be imposed in relation to an employer. There is a lot of statutory authority in this area as well, and we'll look at them as and when we get to it. But before we proceed, we need to understand that employees' liability is quite strict in essence, because it affords an employee the ability to have a safe place of work, adequate material, uh, competent staff to work with, limited workplace stress, and proper systems in place. Now, in Wilson and English, we see these components outlined. The whole premise of employer's liability revolves around the fact that an employer can delegate responsibilities, but not liability. So we'll look at each component in turn. <laughs> 